Hey guys, this is Killer Bits here. Um, if you notice, uh, I actually just posted a video. Um, I would I would go ahead and post this video tomorrow, but I can't because uh, some video software on my computer is not functioning properly. I need to get that repaired. So I'm going to go ahead and do this video while I can get it posted. I uh, apologize to anybody that subscribed. I know you guys don't want everybody popping up there twice. Um, in any event, what, what I'm going to talk to you a little bit about is, um, you know, um, a little bit of the hip hop culture, if you will. Um, and I'm going to ask you guys a question. And our question is um, Do you really think a rap battle is necessary? Are they necessary now? Because um, they certainly were, were somewhat necessary in the past. Um, are they necessary now? Yes or no? I would like you to leave comments in the comment section below, um, if you will. Um, and. <sighs> Let's go ahead and talk a little bit about rap, um, hip hop, maybe just music in general for you. But I'm gonna I, I relate to rap because that's what I do. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell you a little bit about my struggles. You guys can comment on these. Uh, you know, maybe you can ask me a question. Maybe I can help you out a little bit. Maybe you can help me. Um, you know, I number one thing that I come across when I try to do something is I, when I rap or when I try to get a flow or when I try to select the beat is you know a lot of times you have something in your head and you can't get that that idea to what to what you're trying to do um like I get a lot of times I get a beat and I'm like that beat sounds good that beat sounds good and then you, you just listen to the beat and you try to come up with words to that beat before you know before you really think it out like because that beat has a certain feel, or it has, you know, a certain mood to it, you, you're going to go ahead and spit those kind of lyrics. But the problem that I have, and I'm sure a lot of you other people have as well, is when you try to spit those lyrics to that beat, you're spitting what's in here, you're spitting then what's in your mind to the beat. And, uh, and they're not necessarily the mood of the beat. You spit to the mood of the beat, like, to the actual da-da-da-da-da-da, you know? But... You know, to actually get into the mood of the beat and get into what you're trying to say on the track, uh, you know, don't be repetitive, and that's and that's really hard sometimes for me to do as well. Um, you know, and another thing is like, you know, rhyming itself it becomes uh, very, <clears throat> it becomes very monotonous, especially when you're coming up and trying to learn how to rhyme. I know for all the beginners out there, I'm I'm not too far away from you. I've only been doing this about a year, a year, a little bit over a year. So I mean, I know when it's very frustrating. You get, you get those, uh, you get the beat, and you get the, and you get the rhyme, and you, you go through, you know, you get these kind of books. People get these kind of books all the time, and they're not, uh, they help, but they're not. This is not a, this is not a substitute for the mind power. Um, and it gets frustrating. It really does. But you got to keep, you got to keep going on the grind, and it's really frustrating. I mean, you can ask your roommate. Um, I'm not the most livable person in the world when I'm doing this, um, because it's, it's definitely frustrating. I just want to kind of get you guys' feedback on, you know, you know, how do you feel about rap, how, how do you feel about rap, and what's your struggle in rap? I mean, uh, you know, how do you, how do you overcome those struggles? I know for me, I just keep plucking. Uh, a lot of times it doesn't, you know, so, sometimes that works, sometimes it doesn't. For some people it does, sometimes it doesn't. I know for me it works most of the time. Sometimes I get burnt out on it, and I have to I have to step away from it. I had to do that recently. I had to step away because you know you get you get so focused, and you get and you're like I gotta get this, I gotta get this. That you that you get burnt out on it. I mean, even though you love the art form, you get burnt out. Um, so I mean, you know, just go ahead and leave me comments. Uh, you know, subscriptions are always nice. I'm gonna try to get a kind of sub base, and we're gonna get those freestyles rolling here shortly, guys. Um, other than that, I mean, really, you know, I, the, the thing that I can really tell you guys, I mean, if you're a beginning rapper, uh, if you're if you're just coming up, if even if you're not in rap, if you're in music, or any type of uh, you know, any type of job goal or or career, what you want to do is, you want to be like, you always want to be positive and you want to keep going toward it. Um, if you get negative and you start and you start being like, oh, you know, then you can't do it. Now. <clears throat> That because you got to stay, you know, somewhat within the realm of reality. I'm going to touch on this, and I'm actually going to make this into a video uh, for later on. But I think what we're going to talk about next is having a dream, like having 
go you set you set yourself some goals, um, but realistic goals. Um, and I had a problem with this myself. It was uh, you know when I was starting out, and you know sometimes still do it. I find myself going for this goal. Well, is this goal realistic? Is this a realistic goal for me? Is this a realistic goal for the path that I'm choosing? Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and tell, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and make that into a video. Just make sure that you guys tune in for that. Um, but here, in summary, I mean, really, just keep your goals simple um, and keep them short so that you can see progress. I'm gonna to touch on that a little bit more uh, on the next video, but I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a heads up. That way, you know what's coming at you next. All right, and guys, like I said, always uh, likes, comments, and subscribes are nice. As always, guys, this is Kill the Bits, and I'll talk to you later.